Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm the real Andy of Burberry Heels and I'm here to talk to you everything Housewife Bravo and a little bit more related. And today I'm here to talk to you guys about Real Housewife of Potomac, a little tea. But before we get into it, please go and subscribe to my channel right now. Please subscribe to my channel, activate that little bell, and let's just become friends. All right, guys, now that you subscribe to my channel, so this is about Ashley Darby, got, all right, from Real Housewife of Potomac, finally, like, picking a side on this whole drama that is happening. I did a video about this, like, um, the whole drama that is going on. We already know kind of what is going to happen on Potomac for, you know, the previews of the season. But the thing is, like, there is so much drama going on, like, right now about what happened over there. So, I think even, like, the drama that is happening right now, it's, like, more juicy than what we are seeing on on the screen, right? So, um, you know that Candace tried to sue Monique, and we don't know what is going to happen over there. Giselle is talking here. Robin is talking there. But we didn't, like hear anything about Ashley who has been a little bit quiet I think I'm guessing because you know like she was on the middle of the storm for some season so maybe it was like kind of nice for her to not be in the middle of like anything for now but she goes on and she uh, she did an interview with uh, the Daily Mail Australia and they were talking about the season and everything that happened and she goes and she says that she 100% takes Monique's side over Candice. Candice. I don't know how to say her name. Um, she goes on and she said that the, the problem with Candice is that she doesn't know when to stop. So she is like one of those chihuahuas. She just go and bark and bark and bark and bark and bark and bark and they don't know where to shut up, you know, or where, when to stop. Um, she said that she has made it very clear to everyone, including Monique and Candice, that um, she really value the women that Monique is, okay? And that, yes, they had some issues in the past, but when things were really rough for Ashley, Monique was there for her and helped her through a lot of things. While Candice, on the other side, literally was like tweeting or texting all kind of mean stuff to Ashley at the same moment that she was having a kid. Like she was in labor and she was receiving all these tweets and uh, texts from Candace, okay? So she says, this girl, she doesn't know when to stop. She just talks and talks out of her ass and she doesn't know when to stop. So I am 100% Team Monique because she is right. I don't know guys, what do you think about this? I mean, the whole deal is gonna be very explosive. The whole fight between Monique and Candice is gonna be out of this world. We haven't had one of these since Portia attacked uh, Kenya on Atlanta. So we will have to wait to see really what happened over there. But I think at this point it's pretty clear to like almost everyone that it is Candace's fault. So what do you think guys? Let me know in the comments below whose side are you? Are you team Monique? Are you team Candace? And let me know why. All right guys, that's it for this video. Please like, share, and overall subscribe to my channel and I'll see you around. See ya.